Welcome back to the OpenShift Bootcamp free course. In today's video, we will be diving into OpenShift cluster operators. Cluster operators are essential component of OpenShift providing extension APIs and other infrastructure services within the cluster. Let's get started. So what exactly are cluster operators? Well, they are essentially regular operators, but with one key difference. Unlike regular operators managed by the Operator Lifecycle Manager or OLM, Cluster operators are managed by the cluster, sorry, OpenShift cluster version operator, also known as CVO. Now, let's take a closer look at the different services provided by OpenShift cluster operators. These services uh, include uh, the network operator, manages the networking capabilities within the cluster. Then we have Ingress, handles the incoming uh, network traffic and routes it to the appropriate services. The storage um, operator will deal with the persistent storage needs uh, of applications running in the cluster. Then we have authentication, provides authentication mechanisms for user access and security. Then we have console, offers a web-based console interface for managing the OpenShift cluster, uh, cluster. Then we have monitoring, then we have image registry, uh, image registries for manage the storage and distribution of container storage within the cluster. The console operator offers a web-based console interface for managing the OpenShift cluster. The monitoring operator handles monitoring and alerting functionalities for cluster components. Image registry is there to manage the storage and distribution of container images within the cluster. Then cluster autoscaler is the OpenShift API server is the uh, which exposes the OpenShift API to, the, to interact with the cluster, then DNS, uh, OpenShift Controller Manager, then Cloud uh, Credential, uh, which handles the authentication and other authorization of the cloud providers, and so on. Now we know the, the services cluster operators provides. How can we identify them within our OpenShift cluster? Well, there are a couple of ways to do this. First, remember that each operator and its managed application share the same project so uh, by looking at the project within your cluster you can identify which operators are present secondly every cluster operator defines a custom resource of type uh, cluster operators by checking the extents of these resources you can identify the cluster operators running in your OpenShift cluster let me show you uh, how to identify them within your OpenShift cluster using the command to see the list of cluster operators in your cluster, you can use the command oc get cluster operators. Running this command will display the names of all the cluster operators present in your cluster. As you can see in the output, each cluster operator is listed with its name and current status. This command provides a quick way to get an overview of the cluster operators running in your OpenShift cluster. To see the list of cluster operators in your cluster, you can use the command oc get cluster operator. Running this command will display the names of all the cluster operators present in your cluster. As uh, you can see in the output, each cluster operator is listed with its name and current status. This command provides a quick way to get an overview of the cluster operators running in your OpenShift cluster. You can see the cluster operators via the OpenShift web console as well. Go to administration, cluster settings and then check the cluster operators section. And that's a wrap for today's video on OpenShift cluster operators. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions or need further clarification, please feel free to leave a comment below. See you in the next video.